Hey guys, ExtremeRD here from the SC Gamers. Today I will be showing you what a centrifuge is. I'll be talking a bit about the uranium ore in the volts pack, and I'll be showing you how to process uranium so it can be used inside a fission reactor. So let's get right to it. So I've constructed this nice little blast proof building right here, SCG Labs as you can see, and Waldo has even left his mark here. What a guy. Alrighty, ooh, bit of lag. So let's get right to it. So to build the centrifuge right here, this is the recipe right here. You need four bronze ingots, two steel plates, two motors, and an elite circuit. And in case you've forgotten, here's how you construct a motor right here. So you need some steel, copper wires, and iron ingots. And then, and then to construct an elite circuit, you'll need gold bars, lapis block, and two advanced circuits. And to build an advanced circuit, here's the recipe, but I went over that when we built the fission reactor. So you can refer back to that video if you need more. So, and here's our centrifuge right here. And just to show you, this is what uranium looks like right here. Now, if you take off your hazmat suit or you're near it, you pick it up without your hazmat suit on, you will get hurt. You get some radiation. So, that's not good here. I'll just take it off right here. There we go. You just put it in your hand, you touch it, hop on it, you get some radiation. Not sure why it's not happening right now, but that's usually what happens. So, let me put on my armor again. Hazmat suit, rather. This can be picked up with anything above an iron pickaxe. So right here, but uranium is extremely rare. There are only four uranium blocks for every one chunk. So just so extremely rare, it's just insane. Now you should see this spinning up here in just a second. It's not spinning for some reason. Let me go set up some generators. I'll be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. I have set up my little solar farm back there, generating some power for us. Now that we have our centrifuge all hooked up, now if you notice from the bat box coming out of the black end going to the front end right here, you can see this little pallet right here with a slanted edge. That's the input for the power. Now, when you put in your uranium ore, it takes precisely 600, or not 1600, my bad, 16 minutes and 40 seconds for a full one process, one uranium process to take place. So that's 1,000 seconds, so nearly 17 minutes, so hopefully you've got something else to do while your centrifuge is processing your you, your uranium. Well, that's a tongue twister right there. But um, this does take about 5,000 kilojoules of energy, so that's not considerable, but it does take up your power if you've got your bat box hooked up to a bunch of other machines. But that is all for the centrifuge today. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial, and if you did, Oh, I almost destroyed the centrifuge back there. But if you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you'd like to see more Volts tutorials like this one. Thanks for watching, guys.